Well, Gary Pratt was the standard for guard defense during most of his 17 seasons in the league. GP made the NBA's all-defensive team nine times and was the 96th Defensive Player of the Year. In fact, the only guard to win the award the last 30 seasons, if you can believe that. I believe it. <laughs> You've probably heard that before. I believe yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, I believe it. But it's I a little had crazy watch, if you think about it. I had to watch it against the Phoenix Suns for a long time, and despite that, I love the glove, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So we thought, because, you know, the obvious doesn't escape us, with GP in the house here, we wanted to know what guards, and especially point guards, impress you in terms of their defense. Well, you, you, know, you know what, Matt? I, I always go with the OGs first. I'll go with the OGs. I'm going to go with Chris Paul. Uh -huh. Chris Paul. Everybody really don't understand that uh, he's not really an on the on the ball uh, defender, but he's almost like uh, um, uh, uh, Deion Sanders. Yeah, he's in everywhere. He's getting the interceptions. Yeah. He's getting his hands on the ball. He's doing all that. But the guy that I think that is the greatest, the greatest um, on the ball player, is uh, Beverly. Beverly can be on the ball. He can hawk you. He can do things. He wants to turn you. He wants to make it hard for you to do the, to, to, to do the, uh, everything. Then I got the kid from Smart from Boston. He's great, too. He has a lot of energy. He goes like I do. He doesn't back down from anyone, and that's why I like him, and he makes things happen. He makes things happen on the floor with his defense. And then I come to Rondo. You know what he does. He goes back. He's almost like a John Stockton to me. He's always around the basketball. You think he's gone, he'll come back, get a steal, get a, uh, get a block, get a great play like he always does. And then everybody's going to talk to me about this one. I'm going to go with the young kid ball. I think that in a couple of years, he can be a great basketball player. I think in the summer, what he has to do is he has to go and work in his game. But on this end, on, on defense, right. he's so long, and he stays with you. Look, he gets his hands on balls. He gets blocked shots. 50-50 balls with this kid is his ball, and he gets it done. And when he gets it done, he makes the right play. He makes the pass. He makes a steal come in to be something great for the Lakers. He always do it like that, and I like these five guys. People have spent so much time during his rookie season criticizing the things he doesn't do well. I think they've missed that part of his game. He's 6'6 six, six for one. And Luke Walton has said he's been their best defensive player over the course of the season. And I've been watching him all year. And I watch him all year. He gets rebounds. He gets, he gets great um, um, steals. And, and he's on the ball. Mm -hmm. Because he doesn't steal, I always say, you can turn a basketball game around with other things. He doesn't have that skill yet, but he does have the skill of playing defense, getting rebounds, and making the right play. He has a great vision. And to me, on the ball, he's a great, he's a great defensive player.